into the world. Adam and Eve had not even sinned yet, and yet already they're given a choice between the tree of life and the what? The tree of knowledge of good and evil. So the fall of man, according to the rabbis, was because Eve sinned and then led Adam to sin. But this is patriarchal propaganda against females, against the old matriarchal systems. It's bullshit. The Jews wrote that in. That's not the original conveyance of the records. It wasn't the fall of man because man sinned. It was the fall of man because man had completely been ended in a horrifying cataclysm. Simple as that. That cataclysm was 3895 BC. This is why in Genesis chapter 1, we have a new heavens and a new earth. This new heavens was the vapor canopy. Phoenix had brought it. 3895 BC is a Phoenix year. So everything comes together. All this research, which is independent threads of knowledge derived from many different sources, in 3895, they all coalesce and come together perfectly. All these ancient records like Genesis chapter 1 and the Enema Elish, the Atrahasis epic, and all, they all tie into this event. So this is the origin of the Phoenix phenomenon because 138 years after that, counting like clockwork, we have the Great Flood. Then we have the Ogygian deluge. Then 138 year multiples to 1411 BC. We have we have the conquest of Canaan when the Israelites were fighting the Canaanite cities, and all of a sudden the sky darkened and rocks fell out the sky and destroyed the Canaanites. So the Israelites easily took Bashan and all these cities and settled the land. This is in the Bible. That was a Phoenix episode, 1411 BC. Then we had uh 138 years before that was 1549 BC, and historian Castleden says that the Aegean suffered a cataclysm at that time. I'm not making all this up. That's a real historian who published a real book that I cite, and that's a real date he provided. Just like W.J. Perry wrote a 550-page book all about the children of the Sun dynasties and how they all collapsed on a single day in the year, he says, about 1688 BC. Here's a man that wrote a book over 100 years ago, 550 pages of data. His conclusion is, is that every Bronze Age civilization in the world collapsed, suffered a total reset. He never explains why, but he pinpoints it in his research to, six, to about 1688 BC. But Stephen Jones, in The Secrets of Time, said the exact year for that collapse was 1687 BC. Me, with my 138-year Phoenix periodicity, shows exactly how it was 552 years after the Great Flood, which was a Phoenix cycle, which is 138 times 4. It, too, is on the Phoenix cycle. This 138 years moves all through history up to 2040, 18 years from now. So, evil pre-existed mankind. I believe that we are not guilty of anything. We are victims. So that's that. I hope that answers your question. Evidence of that is the tree of knowledge of good and evil pre-existed man's disobedience.